Do you also want to create a progress tracker using symbols like this? It's very easy. I will show you how to create this table step by step. First, add a checkbox to your table. Select the range where you want to apply the checkboxes. After selecting the range, go to Insert and click on the checkbox option. All checkboxes have been added successfully. Next, click on the progress column and write a formula to calculate progress based on the checkbox status. Press the equal sign and write if, then open the bracket. Next, type count if, open the bracket again, select the range of checkboxes, press a comma, select the criteria, and type true. Close the brackets. Press the greater than sign and type zero, then press comma. Type rept for the repeat function, then open the bracket. Type inverted commas, press alt plus 30 for a symbol, then press comma. Write count if, open the bracket, select the range, and choose the criteria true. Close the brackets twice, and then press comma to continue the formula. Now that the true condition formula is complete, we will write the false condition formula. To do this, simply copy the same formula without the equal sign. Then paste the formula for the false condition. Now, in the pasted formula, change true to false. Next, change the symbol. For the false condition, you can change the symbol. To do this, press Alt plus 31. Then, in the pasted formula, change true to false again. At the end of the formula, press inverted commas, then close the bracket, and finally press Enter to apply the formula. Now, you can drag the formula down to apply it to all rows, and your progress tracker will automatically update with the corresponding symbols for both true and false conditions. That's it! You have successfully created a progress tracker with symbols. The practice file link is available in the description. If this video is helpful to you, please like and follow for daily tips and tricks.